Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'll be teaching you the fastest way to get money in Ultimate Driving. Alright, let's get into it. Alright, so the first thing you're gonna want to do is, so let's say you actually want to earn some money. Quickest way, get your top paying car. So my top paying car is, let's wait for it to load, is my, where is it? My Ancona Z1. Z L, sorry. And if I click on it, it says... Base reward $1,197. That means that's how much money I'll get every time I drive a mile. So I'm gonna drive that. It's my best car. Car. And oh, okay, don't know what happened there. But you just wanna drive around basically. So find the highway, whatever, drive along. Now, I'm in Odessa, a map called Odessa. Now if I would recommend if you would like to go for this option, I'd rather you can go on Westover. Westover is better as see this green road? That's one highway. Look how flipping long that if I can move my cursor. Look how long oh my, oh my god. Look how long it is. It starts up here, then it goes all the way down. My cursor! Ah, you get the point. It goes all the way down, all the way to what you saw before. Right now I'm in Odessa because I don't know, why not? But anyway. So you just drive around, I'll show you in a second. Keep on driving, keep on driving. Just wait for it. Keep on driving. Oh no, and there's some car there. Right. I said I never saw that guys. Yeah, you also get fined for doing stuff like that. But anyway, look at that. $1,197. That's what you get every mile. <clears throat> now I'm going to move into our second one. All right. So for this one, guys, if I could, you just want to. It's becoming a mailman, all right? If you didn't know, we're going to go back to our spawn that we were before. This is a pretty fast car. So we'll head back to our spawn there. Now, actually, we don't, because. Sorry about that guys. Anyway, what you want to do is you want to go to jobs here and then you go down to mailman, join job. Alright, just wait for a timer here or whatever. You might not have it, I do. Wait for it and you will end up joining that job. Alright, so now you want to go to enter dealership. Depending on which map, it depends how, where the layout is. So you want to go to dealership. If you're new to this, yeah, I own every vehicle, but, okay, sorry about that. Yeah, but you basically want to buy the mail truck, so it's basically a van, and this is it, you want to buy it at 15000 alright, once you have that, if you don't have enough money, just go earn some money, let's drive, yep, and I'm in the truck, now, what happens is when you go to so you gotta go here, pick up mail. I've already picked up mail, that's why I have 50 outbound mail. You wanna go drive around pretty much. If you see any houses that have a mailbox and has this symbol on it, that means you can pick up mail from it. It's like that, $100 each time. Now if you get really good at it, you can just, I think the best place to do it is Odessa, the biggest land. Look, you just keep on driving along. Stopping, picking up mail, dropping it off, and a hundred. All right. Now the next tip that I want to show you is there's one more. Now this one might be a little hard. Like this one's not the most efficient animal, but it's becoming a police officer. So you want to go to jobs. You go to police officer. Now the only problem is this costs. Oh, I have to sell my bounty. But this costs Robux, 45 Robux. Then you join it. So, I'm going to have to go pay for my bounty right now. I do not know where the police station is. Okay. Whatever just happened then, I just got too much bounty and I got sent back to Citizen. Alright. Okay. Well, what you want to do is basically... <clears throat> so, once you have your job of being a police officer, I'll just tell you right now, is you get into a police car and... People have bounty around them. So if there's a police officer, they could arrest me right now. Because, look here. Orange means they can arrest you and send you to jail temporarily. 
See, if you look at here, you can have a read for yourself, but you can see all the different things that a police officer can do. So it's pretty good, but the only thing is you don't want to get too much bounty, otherwise you'll get sent back to a citizen. That is really good though, so... Fortunately, I have no idea where the police station is, but... Hope to see you back in another video, guys. That's it for today's video. See you later.